Welcome to the Ship Automation Demo. I'm going to show you three use cases for the Ship Automation Tool. The first is bulk outbound shipping. So if you want to ship or fulfill lots of orders at the same time, we make it really easy to select your orders and ship them. I'm going to view my unshipped orders and I can select up to 1,000. But for this demo, I'm going to ship to three. And this works for our UPS, USPS, and FedEx apps. I can choose the service type, specify the package weight and declared values. All of the values here can be pulled in from different fields on your various objects. When I'm ready to ship, I can just hit Create Shipments and a validation process will occur to ensure that all of your shipment data is valid. Once the validation is passed, each shipment will be tendered to FedEx and the shipping labels will be created. Also, if you have thermal printers, our apps integrate directly with them as well. So with a single click, you can print 1,000 labels directly to your thermal printer. That's the first use case, high volume order fulfillment. The second use case is suited to a call center or RMA case returns process. So if I want to view a case with Shipmate, I can go through the shipping wizard and create a shipment. But if the characteristics of the shipment are the same each time, you can predefine those. We've predefined those in a custom setting, and now I can just click this Create FedEx Return button. The app will tender the shipment to FedEx, and it will take the user straight to the shipping label, which can be emailed directly to my customer. This is great for an e-commerce, retail, manufacturing process where you send lots of return shipments. The third and final use case is for e-commerce and self-service returns. This is a Force.com public website and this can be embedded within another Force.com website or even one of the popular e-commerce platforms like Magento, Shopify, or Demandware. So if the user wants to return an item, the user can simply enter their order ID, click View Label, and it's going to generate a return label for them. They can attach the return label to a package, schedule a pickup, or drop off the package at a carrier center. You can track the inbound process of this return shipment. Every hour in Salesforce, the shipment tracking status automatically updates so you can always see the very latest status of the shipment. Thanks for watching and feel free to contact us if you'd like more information about automating your shipping processes in Salesforce.